Hello dear traders, you're watching InstaForex TV, I'm Anna Kasatkina, back with another look at the most recent financial events that might move the markets today. Wednesday, the Russian stock market is being on the rise despite new sanctions imposed by the EU and the US. The RTS and MySix indices rose by more than 2%. Meanwhile, in Europe, there are completely different sentiments. Investors are selling shares on the stock exchanges in Frankfurt, Paris and even London. The stock's Europe 600 index also has gone into the red zone. Only Spain does not support the overall dynamic, with its IBEX 35 index growth growing amid strong GDP data. New sanctions cover energy, defense and financial sectors. Western companies are banned to supply innovative technologies for oil extraction to the Russian Federation. Such a ban may cause difficulties in the development of hard oil deposits in the future, but there is no serious threat to the current supplies of the fuel to the world market. The sanctions imposed against the Russian Federation have no significant significant impact on prices for both major brands, light, sweet and brand. If today's data on oil and petroleum inventors in the United States is strong, oil prices will advance and WTI can break out the significant resistance level of $101.50 and head to the next level of $102 per barrel. The price of oil could rise sharply if Kremlin, in a response to sanctions, holds deliveries to Europe. However, such a scenario is very unlikely, because in this case the Russian economy will be affected as well. Experts consider the sanctions to be ineffective. In other countries, such as Iraq, Iran, North Korea and South Africa, as well as many others affected by the Western restrictions, bans did not bring desired results. In the case of Russia, which is rich in natural resources and food, it is very hard to do real damage. A temporary decline in stock prices is possible in the future, but finally production will strengthen without any foreign supplies. And this was daily financial news from InstaForex. Thank you and see you tomorrow. Bye.